Hey guys, it's uh, In the Black and Reagan here, and uh, this is my old Easton glove. I used it for this year, and it's a uh, piece of crap. There's um rips inside and everything. It's horrible. I uh, use it to mess around with now with my friends and everything. Because I got a new glove I'm about to show you in a second. It's alright. It's alright to play around in, but I wouldn't take it seriously for anybody. Because it's not that good of a glove. So if you're going to go out and you see this glove, it doesn't really have a name. Let me see one second. Uh, the name is worn out, so I can't really see, but it's uh, the Easton. looks just like this. If I see a bigger, smaller model, this is a 12. And uh, boys, um, do not buy this glove. If you're beginning, maybe, but if you're intermediate, or do not buy this glove. And uh, here's my other glove I'm about to show you right now. One second. This is my baby. I got this uh, a couple weeks ago, and it's a little bit broken in and bro broken a bit fast. Still squeeze it, but it's not fully broken in. This is the uh, this is the 2011 new Mizuno Premier. Mizuno. It's an uh Pro series. The brand new netting this year. I like the netting where it's crisscross. I like the crisscross netting because I think it's stronger, more durable. But this is nice too. It's Premier Pro. I think this was $125. I'm not positive. But, um, yeah. It's, uh, pretty good. It holds up pretty good. I, like I said, I only had it for, like, a couple weeks. Uh, baseball season just ended. But, um, I'm doing travel team, so I'm going to break in this glove a lot. So, um, yeah. Make sure you choose this glove over this glove. You can just tell. This is more thicker leather. This is a thin leather. So you can't feel it, but if you were to go like this with it, this is way more heavier. And this glove is light. This means the leather is more durable. And, uh, yeah. Thanks for watching. Check out my other vids. Subscribe. Like. Comment. Thanks. Peace.